Hello and welcome to The Loop. I'm Matt Bruding. And I'm Renata Ford. Thanksgiving is right around the corner, and that means roads will be busy with lots of extra travelers. An analysis of traffic data found these are the best and worst times to travel on Ohio roads around the Thanksgiving holiday, so plan accordingly. One of the best tools you can use is Ogo.com and the Ogo app. It gives you access to more than 1,000 traffic cameras, real-time traffic alerts, construction zones, and more. Of course, while many of our work zones will be reduced in size for the holiday, there are some locations in Ohio where those orange barrels just cannot be moved. This includes I-70 in Zanesville and through downtown Columbus at the I-71 interchange, I-75 in Cincinnati, Dayton, and Toledo, and several projects in the Akron area. Be sure to allow extra time to travel through these areas. Slow down and obey all signage in these and all work zones. The Ohio State Highway Patrol and other law enforcement agencies will be out to ensure you are being a safe driver. One of our statewide traffic management supervisors shows us that state troopers won't be the only ones watching our roads to keep them safe. No Stark Tower, but the Statewide Traffic Management Center, or TMC, located in Columbus, Ohio, works 24-7, 365 days a year to keep the state of Ohio safe and moving. We are the eyes and ears of ODOT, providing real-time traveler information through various roadside devices. Colin Thomas and Trey Hildy tell us more about how the TMC is a vital function to Ohioans and ODOT. Hi, my name is Colin Thomas and I work in ODOT's Traffic Management Center. And my name is Trey Hildy. I am a specialist in the TMC. So the TMC is really a, a central hub of information between ODOT and the general public. We're actively monitoring roadway conditions. So we're taking calls all across the state. A lot of our calls can range from uh, debris in the roadway to traffic crashes to goats running around on the freeway. That's happened. Yeah, it has happened. We publish everything to OGO. From there, the general public can get all the information they need to make sure they're getting where they need to be safely, quickly, and efficiently. Ohio's TMC is rather unique. We perform the entire state of Ohio out of our office. We're a much more efficient setup, saving taxpayers a lot of money. 88 counties, over 1,000 cameras, more than 43,000 miles of roadway, and one office with 15 staff. The ODOT TMC is there to guide motors through any unusual traffic conditions. Who knew? Thanks, Dom. We'll also be reminding you to be safe with a little humor mixed in by posting several messages on our digital message boards across the state. There's always the fan favorite, Turkey Says Buckle Buckle. That is a tradition. The holidays are also about giving back to our communities. Here at ODOT, we are big on giving back to the communities we serve. Over the last three years here at District 4, we have held a Thanksgiving Day canned food drive to help out families in need here in Northeast Ohio. And we are proud to announce that during this time, we have donated over 2,200 meals to those in need. Once the food is all collected here at the districts, we then take the food to a local food bank. And I was actually able to catch up with Alex from the Akron Canton Food Bank here in Summit County. And he talks about the importance of giving back and what food banks do once we drop off the food. The food bank could not do what we do without organizations that are donating food and product to us. One in eight individuals are food insecure in Northeast Ohio. So it's right here in our own backyards. And so that's the importance of giving back right here locally. Food is dropped off at our back facility right here at the back door. From there, it's sorted by our volunteers to making sure all the product is safe, nothing's damaged, broken, open. And then it goes onto our online menu. We're so, so, so grateful for your guys' support because we couldn't do what we do without you all. Thank you to everybody that has donated and will continue to donate throughout the holiday season. Your generosity is greatly appreciated and it does not go unnoticed. Thanks a lot, Ray. Well, we'll take a break next week, but you can always get more ODOT news online at transportation.ohio.gov by following us on social media and keep sending those great story ideas and feedback to loop at dot.ohio.gov. Happy Thanksgiving, and now you're in the loop.